Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about how to install the Inside plugin for lighting and solar. Um, if you haven't seen my previous videos, I used to talk about how to do the daily daylight analysis, solar analysis in the Revit. And it's very, very convenient and easy for bigger projects, smaller projects. Um, I have done my master's dissertation through Revit uh, lighting analysis. Um, however, I used to use 2021 um, version of Revit and up till last year it was very much convenient. I used to, uh, I also added a tutorial on how to install the plugin for the Revit over your Revit or Revit uh, software over here. Um, however, um, due to something, I changed my computer and I wanted to uh, install the Revit again. So this time it's Revit 2022. However, when I came here, um, I could not find this ener energy analysis tab. It's it's, it's here now however when I opened it was not there I remembered I have done a video on it that I searched Google and and then I could find the um, plugin for it so I have done that and it takes me over here so this page says that um, till Revit 2021 right now it's not, it must be downloaded the solar analysis and lighting analysis are available to download on manage Autodesk but uh, how I used to download my plugins before it was through here and it's not available right now for my version so I went over here, so it opened up to this place. Um, since I have an educational license, uh, it opened to my own portal of Autodesk. Um, I have uh, I, I came across this part where it says that inside energy analysis, green building studio, lighting analysis, and it says access now. So I opened over here. Uh, it comes up to here, access now. Um, it says some tutorials, inside features and everything, get started. I have went here, there is nothing. I went here, download, and then it brings me back over here. So I struggled for a good 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Um, I finally found how to do it. Uh, do it. So let's, let me show you how. So once you come here, uh, in your portal or even not here over here we need to go to custom install or uh, if you come here you will be it, it will be written more custom installs and deployments if we open it it's the same thing as custom install so over here uh, as you can see, analysis, I have already uh, purchased or uploaded uh, one I have installed, which is the one which you see over here. Um, I have downloaded it as a package. This is here. This is the name analysis I have given before. So uh, basically what you have to do this time is you have to download the lighting and solar analysis as a package or as a custom install. It doesn't come anywhere in your software uh, or products and services, product of this, nothing. So what you have to do, you need to come here, custom install. You need to click on create new. Over here, you will see all the products you have. I only have Revit and AutoCAD at the moment. So I will be clicking on Revit to download its all other plugin versions. Um, you will be here seeing latest or specific. I have a specific which is Revit 2022. So I'm not going to select these. As you can see, it's still 2021. Um, Revit 2020 doesn't uh, allow over here. So I'm going to go here. This is the latest version. I have not updated. If you uh, if you um, if you have updated your uh, Revit through the Autodesk desktop app, um, you can go for these. But I'm going for these. So I have selected this one. 
Now comes customization, extensions, and content. So customization, um, it's 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 different things. I have not touched it yet, and when I was downloading, I did not touch it. You could um, maybe take or untick some of these like uh, different languages if you don't need them. You could do that. I have not done that. I just kept it as it is. Uh, the, the important one is over here, the extensions. What are the extensions you need? So if you go down, you will be seeing the lighting, you will see the solar, which is which I have done. I don't need anything else, but you could also add the generative design. Um, I, I probably need that, but I'm going to add that later. There is other stuff like Revit InfraWorks, um, fabrication, um, room book, room room book area book and all these if you need it uh, you could add content again i have not added anything from here but um if you need to add any kind of context from here like family libraries um what we used to do before uh, i'm i don't know if you know but we would uh, go to control panel of our computer find the revit content library uh, repair or install um, uh, install it again or repair it and then add a different uh, library of content like content family libraries or stuff like that um, however right now it's more simplified i used to use the uk content which has amazing furnitures and windows and everything uh, which is actually um, which actually does uh, reflect over here when you go to load family and uh, you have go you go to libraries as you see that I told you I did not untick anything, uh, so I got all of it, but I don't have the UK. I will probably go and download the UK afterwards. Um, however, you get all these. I just got the extension ones, but I did not get other all family members. So yeah, let's let's just let's just go stick here and let's go over here. So I did uh, if you want, if you wish to, you could just tick this and you will say next so in the next um you will just write your package name um you can give anything you want uh, and then you will be agreeing to it and then you will be downloading it so it takes a bit time to download after the download is completed it will get to your uh, computer uh, it's this one which is custom install tool it is written uh, this is I, I give the name as analysis uh, once you just double click it, uh, it it's just going to come as the normal Revit installation you say yes I don't want to because I already have it and you will just install as it is it's the similar one as Revit and then you will be getting your um, lighting and solar tool over here now to just check how it's working i'll just um, for you i'll just make a small wall and um, maybe i'm going to do a roof and uh, yep i will just say yes don't attach and uh, i'm going to just add a flooring let's just say i'm adding a flooring um i have added a, i have shown how to do a lighting analysis in my previous videos so do check that out i'm just adding this as a room and i'm going to add some windows over here um just just say just for the sake of uh, doing some lighting analysis so i'm going to my analyze tab do the lighting i say okay Okay, I'm going to just save it over here. I, I know the way the door, the, the walls are not attached, but uh, let's just ignore that for now. Uh, okay, so I will say okay, because I do want to change afterwards. So yeah, this is your lighting analysis in cloud. Um, it's the same as before. They have lead, daylight autonomy, solar access, everything is the same. Uh, just the way of the inside plugin works have changed. 
um, that's it. Uh, if you need any kind of queries, any kind of um, questions, just leave a comment or email me. I'm dropping my email in the description box. Um, in the past, um, I have got a lot of uh, inquiries about my tutorials, how to do that. I have given tutorials, um, tutor-based tutorials. I have suggested over the email. I have solved problems. So um, I am very much happy to help you guys at any time you want. So just hit me up in that comment and I will see you next time. Bye.